Uh, my name is Adam, I'm the co-founder of uh, Umps Health, um, and it's my pleasure here to share our journey with you over the past five months. This is a picture of my family and my grandpa. Last year, my grandpa fell at home and went to hospital, and when he came out of hospital, he required near constant care to continue living in the house that he'd been living in for nearly 60 years. My family wanted to support him in doing that, but to do so, we needed to uh, up the amount of care we were giving him. This was things like balancing his medication, coordinating his meals, and also visiting his home or checking in on him every day to make sure he's okay. This is a story that's personal to me, but it's by no means unique, and I can already see some heads kind of nodding in, in uh, sort of agreement with me. In fact, one in eight Australians are delivering this type of care to a family member. So that's nearly 50 people in this room in that situation. And the value of that care to Australia is $1.9 billion every year. And while these people do a really good job of looking after people, as a society, we don't do a good job of looking after them, and they're constantly putting someone else's needs ahead of their own. In fact, nearly half of these people had to leave their paid job to undertake unpaid care for their family member, placing them at significant risk of financial vulnerability. I looked to technology to support my family care for my grandpa, but found that he already had what was available. It was a pendant, like this one, worn around the neck. But the problem with this is that we only find out about something after it happens. And the key was, even when my grandpa fell, he wasn't wearing his pendant. So we set out to build something new. Something that doesn't just detect incidents, but can inform family before they happen, and doesn't rely on someone to wear something around their neck. The first person to use this was my grandpa. We call him Umps, and that's where our name comes from. Mm -hmm. Umps health uses a small plug like this to measure older people's interactions with their everyday home appliances, like their kettle, their TV, their microwave, and their fridge. Mm -hmm. Our machine learning platform learns what kind of behavior is normal and raises an alert to family members when we detect an abnormality. We don't wait for something to go wrong. As soon as we detect an, ab detect an abnormality, we send a text message, and the data, that the data that we're collecting acts as strong predictors of incidents like falls and the onset of chronic illness. 18 months ago, this was an idea to support my family caring for my grandpa. When we entered the Math Velocity program, we, had a pro we took that idea to prototype, and now we're in homes across Melbourne. Our research partnership with Melbourne Health is proving the effectiveness of Arms Health in predicting declines in health states. And just last month, we signed an agreement with one of the largest home care providers in Australia to undertake a paid pilot with their clients. We've got a really good understanding of the aged care landscape, and we've got a product that can improve the lives of millions of Australians. But we want to accelerate our impact. We recently opened a seed round of $300,000, which will support our post-pilot engagement and road to commercialisation. And we've also already secured a significant anchor tenant with deep experience in the aged care space. If you're an investor and interested in becoming part of Armsoft's journey, please get in touch with me after the pitches. And if you're not an investor, you can still help us, help the people that are, are the backbone of our nation's healthcare system through our Dream Starter campaign. This is a partnership that Arms Health has with Carers Australia to crowdfund to support raising funds to provide our service free of charge to Melbourne's most vulnerable carers, so we can help them return to work or school and balance caring for their loved ones. Uh, just tonight, uh, ING have also agreed to match every dollar that we raise up to the first $14,500. So if you are interested in contributing, please come and see us at our stand at the front. Thank you.